Patch 9.2 Eternity's End is here, and with it, Shadowlands PvP Season 3. In this video, we'll be covering all of the important changes and features of the new season to help you stay up to date on all things PvP. 9.2 includes Maldraxxus Colosseum, a brand new circular mid-size arena map. This battlefield features three small pillars that can be used to avoid enemies and protect yourself with line of sight. For competitive play, Maldraxxus Colosseum has a portion of open area that benefits casters as well as pillars that are quick to access for melee compositions. A quick tip for range classes, you can use the large starting room to force melee and their healers off of a pillar and into the open field to set up crowd control and unescapable damage. Remember this if you're a melee, be careful of overextending in this position, your healer will thank you. Season 3 will also feature 5 new Cosmic Gladiators PvP trinkets, with unique powerful effects. These trinkets can deal powerful cosmic burst damage, absorb enemy healing, protect you from magic damage, and give temporary immunity to crowd control effects. One of the new trinkets to look out for is the new Cosmic Gladiators Resonator. You can use this trinket to deal large amounts of cosmic damage after a short 4 second window, split amongst all enemies caught in its blast radius. Multiple players using this trinket can cause lethal damage. You can protect yourself from this damage by using the new Cosmic Gladiator's Eternal Aegis. This powerful defensive trinket absorbs magic damage and all incoming cosmic damage. A well-timed Eternal Aegis can completely prevent the damage of one resonator. The PvP Trinket 2 piece set bonus, Gladiator's Distinction, has also changed. In earlier seasons, the set bonus granted a 40% increase to the damage and healing bonus of Versatility. This made Versatility very important to stack for PvPers. In 9.2, the set bonus will change to an increase in primary stat and bonus stamina. While still an important secondary stat, stacking Versatility will be slightly less important this season giving you more flexibility with multiple secondary stat combinations. You'll be able to unlock the ability to wield two powerful legendaries at the same time. In addition to the original legendary effect you've created, you'll also be able to use your unique Class Covenant legendary. There will be many powerful combinations that can greatly increase your defensive and offensive capabilities. You'll need to experiment with these effects to utilize a combination that works best with your playstyle and preferred PvP content. Class set bonuses have also returned to the game. All specializations have their own unique 2 and 4 piece set bonuses. These powerful perks may greatly increase a player's damage, healing, or defensive abilities. You won't want to miss out on the power of these bonuses as they will provide a huge power boost to your character. For PvPers, set bonuses can be acquired through the Great Vault, so make sure to cap your characters to access these powerful sets. Finally. A brand new brawl has been introduced in 9.2, Solo Shuffle. This game mode allows you to queue up by yourself and jump straight into the arena for conquest points and honor rewards. Six rounds of 3v3 will play out with different combinations of players, giving everyone an opportunity to play multiple rounds with each other. After all six rounds are played, the players with more overall wins will claim victory and earn bonus rewards to purchase and upgrade their PvP gear. For more information on the PvP content discussed, check out the links in the description of this video. And don't forget to subscribe to the Warcraft YouTube channel for more content like this in the future. In the meantime, queue up and we'll see you in the arena.